Hey everybody, welcome back to my Rogue Tech campaign. So we are on the third of three episodes where we're taking out the pirates here on this planet. Now the first episode was done by our Pirate Lance. You can see that in Pirate, Pirate Lance episode 15. And they initiated this whole thing by attacking these pirates' main base. And um, they were causing a distraction, trying to pull out away uh, some of this guy's... Um, this is their leader here. Pull away some of his... Uh, mechs so that we can actually get in to assassinate the guy. Now we were able to pull away three medium, one heavy, and a demolisher two from this group. And on the way back to their base to try and reinforce it, they were intercepted by our medium lance, which was the last episode, and they wiped them out. So now it's up to our heavy lance to assassinate their leader here. Looks like they still have two lances of guys here. Probably all heavies. So we're going to have to move in very very cautiously and take these guys down. Now I'm really hoping that we can get in yeah they're gonna see us right away and um, there's a 65 ton 70 and a 60 so we should be okay here I think if we run up against some clan mechs that might be a different story but I'm thinking if they're mostly stock loadouts here comes a fulcrum we should be okay now we're going to have to make sure we take the minimum amount of damage possible. When we absorb these guys. So let's move Flatliner in. Uh, let's walk. Going to give us a better chance to hit. 51, 57. If we sprint, get a little closer. It's still the same. So let's get a little closer but we can because we can use our dead fire ammo. And I do want to remove this vehicle as fast as possible. It is relatively light for what we're used to. Uh, the weaponry on it's not that great, but we're going to fire everything. Okay, one PPC hit. That's good. Alright, let's see what they do now. Keep your eyes peeled, Commander. This looks like an ideal place for You think? Okay, 70 ton are coming in. AC and a laser. We have to keep our speed up, I think, so let's sprint. So, um, actually, let's go with height first. I want to get my lasers on this vehicle first before I start using autocannon ammo. And let's see if we can hit him here. There we go. I'm thinking that um, targeting system, the, the TTS plus three that we have in our, in our light lance, may want to move that into this lance and put it in heights vehicle here okay we got to sprint forward now we're just going to move off to the side a little bit behind this rock so that hopefully they can't see us as well they can still see us over that rock but we'll see what happens i'm hoping for more vehicles but yeah the sensor locks i'm not liking stop it at least we go before them Okay, 95 ton vehicle. Very easy to kill the mechs, so I'm kind of happy about that. Light damage, as long as he's only peppering us with LRMs, I'm okay. Another vehicle. Looked like that was a 95 tonner as well. We'll find out in a second here. Okay, we're not going to like that if they keep doing that. Yeah, another 95 tonner. And the main guy's moving. So, okay. May only be eight in total. Orders. Um, let's move to a position where we can only see one guy. Don't know what our chance to hit. That's the 70 tonner up here, up in front. So let's waste that guy if we can. I know I'm unstable in sprinting. Okay, that's a cataphract. Uh, yeah, we want to take this guy out before he gets close to us. So we're going to fire everything on him. Putting up some big numbers. This should make him completely unstable. Alright, we penetrated him. Yeah, and he's he's running. Nobody can blame you for that, buddy. He's gonna run a sensor lock. Okay, let's see if we can get Vane Skater up there to see him. We can. Okay, so let's open up on him. I think I hit with two. 
Is he unstable? No, not quite. So what do we got here? Oh, he's still got lots of armor on this side. That's fine. You want to miss? That's good. Now, I don't think the pirate's got an XL engine. No, so we have to blow him up. So let's attempt to do that. Let's get in a little closer. I don't want to see anybody else just yet. Got to be full throttle. Because they're going to keep sensor locking us. So we're going to fire everything on this guy. Roger that. This should do some significant... Da oh, you can't miss with the PPC, dude. Should do some significant damage here. Solid yeah. Connection. And now we'll finish up with height here. Maybe we can take his leg. His arm. Other torso. Ooh. Nice shot. Props for that. On that hit. That's not minimal. 60 is not minimal. Confirm. Anything above 25 is not minimal. Okay, let's move into here. All right, let's move. I'm thinking what we're going to do is we're going to do an offensive push on this guy and go for the leg. How much has he got left here? 14. If we hit with one of these, we should take it out. There it is. Got the tag on him, too. Reporting. So there's the knockdown. I'm thinking Vanskater should probably be able to finish him up. Here comes a quick draw. 4H. A little bit of splash, but the instability is not what I'm liking. Boarding, heavy damage. How is the 60 hit, like, not heavy damage? And, like, <laughs> the 8s are all heavy damage. I don't get that. Okay. They still have their assault vehicles left. So this guy's definitely an assault mech. Or most likely to be an assault mech. Damn. What structure are we talking about here? Torso already, eh? Damn it. That's where all my exchangers are too. Okay, using Vigilance if we go, oh, we don't have enough resolve for that. So that's the right torso. Yeah, they got good angles on me here. Uh, I think we'll use him to finish up the... Uh, how much did we lose? Fair bit. So we're going to finish this guy up. CTM. That should give us enough, I think. Bang, you're dead. Tango down. Okay, there's one gone. Thunderbolt. Yeah, line. figures. Okay, let's work on... What are your orders, Skipper? Gotta give these guys somebody else to shoot for here. Okay, what do we got here? Oh, another one. What do you got on you? We can kill this guy fast, so let's try and do that. Let's try and do that. Yeah, they're really applying damage to this Orion. Okay, Flatliner, let's get this Warhammer up here. Let's just stay in the water for now. Moving to position. And we're going to target this Quick Draw. See if we can take him down. Oh, you can't miss with those, buddy. Legs destroyed, though. So he is going down. I think things are going swimming. Don't you? Okay, three of four. What else do we got here? Does he have an XL? I don't think he does. Just a regular engine. He's got a lot in that leg. Ready to rock. Let's get in a little closer. Roger, Skipper. Taking it. 
I think we got enough for that leg. I don't think he's in the woods, is he? Cover. I guess he is, technically. Um, we might have enough for the leg, but we'd have to hit everything in the leg. Let's go after... Might get lucky and take the head off. CT's got what? Let's go after the CT. Best bet. That should do it if we all hit the CT. Yep. Okay, good. He's gone. Two down. They got a sensor lock on me. Yeah, as long as it's you. Hate to say that. So this guy's a regular Thunderbolt. Okay, at least we're getting hit from this, this side now. Damn it. I'm wounded. This could be bad. We're in a bad spot. Alright. Gonna walk it forward. Gonna sprint it forward. Because now we got enough for vigilance. So we're gonna use that. Uh God, what do I do here? Thunderbolt next. I think probably that's the best way to go. On my way, double time. And we're gonna vigilance. And let's get some resolve from killing these guys. So let's fire everything straight on this guy. Okay, he's completely unsteady. He'll probably move first. Yeah. I've been sensor locked. Yeah. Okay. What do they got back here? An 80 and a 75. can't get behind him? I can if I go here. Do I want to do that though? That's a really risky move. Let's move here. We can see the vehicle from here. What are we dealing with? Ontos. Lots of medium lasers and some LRMs. I think the Thunderbolt really has to go first. Let's attack this guy. Hit with everything. Nice. Legs gone. Which means they're probably going to die this turn. Okay, next thing is Flatliner. We're going to go after a CT. We're getting full salvage out of this 4 of 18, so i got to be careful of what I'm going to keep and what I'm going to lose. That's a lot of damage, so we got to kill this guy next. He can't be milleying us. Report. Internal damage. I saw that. So what's his back armor? 65. Okay. I'm your spaniel. We have to ignore the guy on the ground, unfortunately. Double time. Let's go. Actually, let's see what he's got. Mm, yeah, he's still got lots of armor. We're going to have to put this into the back of this guy first. I told you guys many times, do not turn your back to the enemy. That was a gift. Honestly, that was a total gift. Like that, that should not have happened. Good damage on the leg, for sure, but still... That was a dumb move for any pilot. Okay, so we're going to fire on this guy. We're going to go for torso. I want to do as much damage to one side as possible. Now let's see how you handle so there's the right torso. We got the tag on him now. And he punched out. Okay, good. So that's two guys is gone this turn. So they're down to four now. Another Ontos Mark II. Okay, they've shifted their targets because they can't see my uh, Orion right now, which is good news. Bad news for them, good news for us.
Medium laser vomit. Come on, stay up, stay up, stay up. Yeah, you know it, baby. They've blown past my armor. Yeah, but you're still standing. Still standing. Unless you get hit by missiles now. Nope. Okay. Yes, Commander. All right. So we're gonna walk. Increase our chance to hit. We're gonna take on the Antos in the forest. On my way. If we get lucky, we should burrow straight through this guy. 148. Let's see what we can do here. Locking in all weapons. Yep, I should do it. Yep. Okay, excellent. Reporting. Enemy vehicle eliminated. 75 ton are finally moving forward. Okay, Vein Skater has to go last, unfortunately, but Flatliner. I'm gonna move you up first. Yeah, we're gonna move into range here. Just gonna walk it up to get rid of, our, rid of that instability. Fire everything straight on the Santos. And if we get lucky enough. Nope. Good solid hits though. Yeah, we're pretty damn close to killing them. Alright, height. Ready to rock. Let's move forward into the trees here. So we can see what this other mech is. Regular Marauder. Two plasma cannons, two medium pulses, and a medium ER PPC. So we're going to fire everything straight in the vehicle. I have to kill this guy and get rid of him. Okay, good. Can't have him shooting. So much for that little guy. All right, let's see what they do here. 80 ton, I don't even know what it is. I think it's an awesome. If it is, I think we might... Not an awesome, uh, a Zeus. If it is, we're going to take some parts. Orders. So... We're going to just move over here to stabilize and brace. Then we can push forward. Now I have to figure out where we took damage here. It was the arm. So we've got to be careful because that's where one of our Clan Ultra 10s is and we don't have an extra one. So let's move ground zero forward. We're just going to walk it. There's no point in running. And we're going to unload on this Marauder. we got good chances to hit, I think. Well, no, we don't. We're going to fire everything anyway. Okay. Really crappy start. Let's get him moving out of the trees, hopefully. Is he coming down to get me? Nope. Going after the Warhammer. Okay. Fair enough. We didn't actually hit him with a PPC, did we? It looked like he moved when I shot, though. Alright. He's got an NSS in there, too. So, Van Skater. Uh, you're going to move up here gonna walk you up keeping the left side of this guy we're gonna unload I want to have the best chances to hit him let's fire everything okay one hit and let's move flatliner up really lousy chances to hit I don't think it'll matter where we go oh that's a lot better let's move into here we're in melee distance but we gotta start putting some damage on this guy. Okay, he's unstable now. Perfect. Can we get to the side? We can. Better chance to hit from the side. Let's fire everything. Not bad. Got the tag on him. We go before him next turn anyway, so... That guy's like, Waiting for orders. he's supposedly supposed to be the leader, but yet he just hangs back there and like lets all his cronies die. Says the guy who's hanging back here and letting all my cronies die. <laughs> I have no choice though. He could blow my, uh, he could blow my torso off, and I lose too many components to to, uh, to risk that at this moment. But at least I'm contributing to the fight, whereas the other guy's not. Alright. 
That puts him back. Hopefully let's finish this up here. Gonna give this one to Vance Gator. Let's get up in here. Let's get in the trees. 99% chance to hit. Keep our torso turned. And let's go for the CT. I should go, let's go for this torso here. There goes the left torso. I can't even see if we get with anything else there. Critical hit, Commander. It's not bailing out though. He's got balls, I'll give him that. 52 left. Okay, hype, it's all yours. Your order, Just walk it around. I got you. Don't get over that hill yet. We're gonna leave that to Flatliner. Gonna fire on the CT, finish this guy up. All right, one left. Tango is trash, Skipper. Destroy the elite Order. pirate mech warrior. So he's the leader. Um, so in this case, even though I've got really great salvage from this mission, I didn't want to monkey around at all. You can see the kind of damage these guys can put out. If you're facing two, like way more than the number of guys that you normally would want to face, this guy's got a lot. All right, let's hit him hard. Should we do a cold shot to his head? I don't think we can get as lucky as we got, as we got with the Orion in the last mission, but we'll just fire straight out. All right, he's a little bit unstable. Gonna see how many PPCs he was willing to fire here. He's gonna fire all four. Okay, respect, buddy. Okay, so I am ridiculously out of position for this fight. Um, so I'm going to sprint up, Understood. Moving fast. and we're going to launch all our LRMs at this guy. With I thought about trying for a head hit, but more than likely he's got uh, um, a cockpit bonus not to uh, take any damage, so... Alright, let's go in with Vayne Skater first, I think. Can we get a, si a good reliable side shot on him? No, we can't. So let's go here. Just enough turn to him. Alright, so let's fire everything. Not quite the instability I was hoping for. Confirm. I know Millie would do it, but me and Millie don't uh, get along. All right, firing everything on this guy's side. Here we go. Tagged. Should move height first, I guess. He's unsettled. Okay. Commander? Where is his arm? That's his right arm. I have to turn my left side. We could just turn. What's this guy's heat like? Like no heat at all. This is probably a bad move. Actually, you know what? Well, he was on turn one anyway. Do we take the risk? No, I don't want to do that. Let's just fire straight at him. What's his CT got? Not much. Let's fire everything. All weapons are go. Not bad, he's completely unstable now. Let's see what he does. He shot at the most favorable target. Try aiming next. Mech warriors, show them what you've got. Receiving you. I'm not gonna even get a chance to shoot this guy other than using missiles, so we're gonna do this. Let's move. Oh, he doesn't have much left at all. Firing away. Here comes lots of missile fun. That's a hit. Totally a hit. All right, Van all right, Flatliner, you can finish him up. He's he did damage to you, so let's finish this guy off. Gonna fire straight out. Here it comes. Bye bye. Game over. Enemy destroyed. 
Excellent. And that's the end of the pirates here. Mission Alright, we only picked up 134,000. Not a big deal. This is all probably going to be going to repairs. But we didn't lose any components. That's the most important thing. And I don't think we took any major component damage at all. Looks like we're all still intact. Excellent. So a couple of close calls, a couple of arms, and a uh, torso over here down to 61. That could have been bad. All right, so a lot of mech parts. Doesn't look like we have matches for any of these guys, so I'm gonna overlook those for now. Go down here and see what else we got. I'm hoping to get some exchangers or something like that, but I can't guarantee anything because I think we smashed these guys pretty badly. Uh, ER pirate lasers, which give bonus melee damage, but the heat is ridiculous on them. LRM triple plus, eh. Plasma cannon, ER PPCs, pirate PPC. 70 damage for 45 heat, not bad. Tags. EMS, or AMS, sorry. What else we got? TC Cockpit. Hmm, Guardian ECM Warfare Suite. That's excellent. Uh, what else do we have down here? Anything? Double Heat Sink. Oh, yeah, man. Plus three energy. Excellent. So I'm thinking that's probably where I want to go. The ECM Guardian would be nice, too. I could put the Double Heat Sink back. But we need the Heat Sinks right now more than the... Well, no, I don't think we do. I think we need the Guardian more than we need the heat sinks. Yeah, I think I'm comfortable with that. Yeah, this is nice. Okay, what do we get? Thunderbolt part, no problem. Bunch of medium lasers, medium laser minus, triple plus medium laser. Nice, we could put that in a mech somewhere. A couple of LRM-10s, this guy's pretty nice. Um, what else do we get? Anything down here? Pirate ER... And that is it. So not bad. Okay, 160,000 in repairs. So a little bit more than I thought it was going to be. Not too bad overall, though. So, I mean, when we look at things here, let's, let's manage our tasks. We did uh, three three missions, and we don't really have all of our mechs in here. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight in repairs right now. The two days that have passed that uh, the missions take... Um, because it's one day between missions, have repaired a couple of our mechs already. So overall, look at the repair times on these, except for the Orion, which took a lot of damage. The repair times are pretty darn low, and I'm going to move the Orion back, uh, just so we get all the other mechs back and running before that. Cool. So that's three missions up, three missions down. We did an excellent job. We were not able to flip the planet, though. Looks like the Free Worlds League has got a lot more units here than we thought. If we go to the star map, we are going to have to leave the system though, unfortunately, as there's no more missions that we can move against the house, against House uh, America or Free Worlds League. So we're probably going to be jumping over here next to uh, Megarez. Either that or what's how many days here? 18 to Royal Fox. So I think we're going to go to Megarez first. And um, let's just travel there because we've got time to uh, repair our mechs. Actually, how much time before end of month here? If we can have a look real quick. Is it more than 16 days? I think it is. Wow. Uh, yeah, it's 17. So we can move all the way over there. Now we've got some of the mech warriors that are out for a while. Like slide wheels out for 43 days. It took a couple hits. We're going to have to get some... Uh, definitely going to have to get some health in that guy for sure. So let's go to the star map. And we're going to move over there before the end of the episode. And we're going to travel. And once we get the uh, cataract back, what I want to do is see if we can get that plus three TTS in assist into it. Um, see if there's any room to, to wiggle in there. So it's back now. Let's pause. And we're going to look at the mech bay. Have a look at that cataract and see if we cannot squeeze that TTS in it somewhere. So let's refit this. We might already have one in here, but I don't think it's a plus three. Definitely showing... Uh, lacking in the ability to hit for sure. All right, we got a plus two energy in here, so we'll pull that plus two out, and we will replace it with the plus three. Let's drop that in there, and then I think what I want to do is I think we'll leave this like this for now. Do we have we have an ECM Guardian? What's the weight on that again? One and a half tons. What was the, uh, let's go to here, 
let's go to ECM Angel we have the Guardian ECM Warfare Suite is how much? Three tons. Okay, so that's not really gonna work. It's got the plus one to hit with uh, ranged weapons, so that's why I thought maybe if we could switch out the Guardian with this it might help out a little bit more. But the plus one here is uh, is not too bad, so we'll just leave that in here. Confirm that. Now the next thing I want to do is look at the... Where is it here? Still in repair. Warhammer. How many more days to the Warhammer's back? Two days. Okay, let's wait two days. I want to see if I can get that plus two in there. Okay. Wait for the dock here. I don't know how many times I've seen this animation. I still love it. Other than the fact that they're crossing the axis on the editing here, it's really weird how the editing worked on this. Um, I'm not sure actually who did this, but if you guys are watching the video, give me a call because the uh, cross axis, axis cutting, I know you're trying to keep the leopard in view here, but the cross axis, axis cutting has to go. It's terrible. Um, so let's go to the mech bays and have a look at our Warhammer. Let's refit this guy. We already have a plus two energy in here, so we can't really do anything. Now, who else? We have a Black Knight. We have a plus three energy in the Black Knight. The Wolverine, not really worried about that. What about the Spider? I mean, it's already got pretty good chances to hit as it is. The Firestarter, maybe? Where do we put this? This guy has got Ballistic. Um, Wolverine has got the large laser. It might be better if we can try and squeeze it in here. I know we had problems a little while ago. Let's refit this and see if we can get it in here. It'd be nice if that that, uh, that plus 60 weapon can do more damage. There's a lot of cooling pods in here. ECM Guardian, which we need to keep. The ammo we need. There's, I don't think there's really anything we can take out of here. We have to pull out a cooling pod. I don't think I'm prepared to do that. What do we got for heat here? He's pretty flush. If we do do that, so we take the cooling pod out. What do we got for heat here? 5763. Is it worth it? The cooling pod can definitely be used somewhere else. I mean, we we're having a problem with... It was this mech, I think, that was having the overheat problem. With the ATMs. So let's leave it off of this guy. Let's leave, let's leave this the way it was. Okay, so we are going to look at putting that in the fire starter, I think. It's, it's, I mean, the damage that the fire starter was putting out and the flame damage and stuff is well worth the plus two targeting on it and better chances to hit. Now, I know it gets, the flamers get a slight bonus to hit anyway, but I'm thinking that's probably what we want to do here. Um, heat sink is one ton. Is there, this is two tons, the vehicle flamer. We could put a regular flamer in there, but then we're going to be overheating. Once again, what do we take out? We don't have an engine to put in here, right? Hmm. I think we're kind of kind of saddled with what we have here. I mean, if I pull the vehicle flamer out altogether, let's say. And we rely on these flamers only to hit. And then we put in our I mean, that's the other thing, too, is if we do it this way, put in the plus two energy, put that in the head, we could drop another heat sink in it. I mean, we could go with the XL gyro, too. No, we, we're saving that. So let's go this route. We'll put a regular heat sink in, because uh, I know we're overheating quickly. 39. Mm, let's go this route. I still really haven't figured out the math on the amount of heat that these flamers generate in this vehicle. 
So let's just go this route. I think overall that's probably the better way to go. Right. Okay, when we get another XL gyro, we'll put it in there. The Panther is still waiting to come back, so let's have a look here. It's three days. Let's manage our tasks a bit. Let's move the Panther up. Oh, it already is at the beginning. Okay. So let's wait three days. Because we're going to pull the Panther out of service, aren't we? Um, we are. I think I forgot to look at the fire starter here, or the uh, goblin. Does refit the goblin. And we're going to repair everything. Yes, yeah, so we didn't get much out of this guy. Strip it all. Armor's already maxed. So we're just going to confirm this. It's 100,000, but we're going to confirm it. We have to wait 43 days before our... Uh, pilots back anyway before this lance can run again so we've got time to wait here but I think I'll leave this for now um, once the Panthers back we're gonna pull it out of service and we'll refit it with the goblin and then yeah I think at that point um, we should have a half decent lance I think I can do a little bit more with the goblin than I could do with the Panther Okay, double jump. We're almost there. Excellent. All right, five days and we're there. Ah, let's make this a learning exercise. Sorry, I'm just speeding through this to get to where we're going. If it's anything crucial, we'll uh, read those, but if it's not crucial, I'm not going to bother. All right, everything back. So now we can go to the mech bay. And make sure we pull that panther out of service now. So where are you here? Here we go. So we are going to drop you straight out of service. Excellent. So we're not paying for it at the end of the month. And let's see if we can get anything at the store here. Anyways, I'm gonna end the I'm gonna end the video here. I'll see what we got in the store. Um, I don't think there's gonna be anything that we're gonna buy. Um, oh, Clan Astro M6. We got the cash for it. One and a half tons can work in the, in the uh, small lands. Um, anything else interesting here? Doesn't look like it. Same old, same olds. So yeah, well, end, well, I'm gonna end the episode here. Hope you enjoyed it. So that was uh, three missions back to back. And um, if you like the video, please drop a like. If you, if you haven't subscribed yet, please feel free to subscribe. And I'll see you all later.